it's the Joel Shit Show featuring Joel Shit. Hi, welcome to the Joel Shit Show. I'm your host, Joel Shit. What did I do yesterday? This is what happens when you don't rehearse, see? Uh, wow, I woke up and then I watched, oh, the Sharks game was on. Yeah, San Jose Sharks, Washington Capitals. And all of a sudden, in the first period, it was three to nothing, and Alexander Ovechkin was a minus two, and the Sharks were in a fight, and it was Jody Shelley and Donald Brashear, and Donald Brashear kicked Jody Shelley's ass, but it didn't matter because the Sharks were winning. And then in the second period, it was four to nothing, and then Boucher messed up and they scored, and it was four to one, and then it was five to one after two, and the Sharks were still winning. And then in the third period, they got another two goals, and then it was like seven to one or seven to two. No, they got a goal to make it six to two, and then with less than a minute left, Mike Greer scored and made it seven to two, and the Sharks won, and they really dominated the game. And hooray for them! And uh, what's his name? Brent Johnson was the goalie for the Capitals. Why did they not pull him? They just left him out there to get his ass kicked. I don't know who the backup is, but come on! Are you going to let someone just look like a fool for that long? If you don't pull him after the first, you definitely have to pull him after the second when you're down 5-1, but they left him out there. I mean, yeah, it wasn't all his fault. Some of those goals are pretty amazing, though. Devin Setaguchi had a goal, and Mark Edward Vlasic had a nice goal. The defense had nine points. It's a franchise record, so you get a point from a goal or an assist, right? So the defensemen on the Sharks had one goal and eight assists, and the club record was eight points, so they had nine, so they set the new record. They just had eight a few days ago, tying the record. The defensemen score a lot more now because it's the type of offense the new coach, Todd McClellan, wants. So it's a good time to be a Sharks fan. It looked really good. The next game is Wednesday against the Blackhawks. And maybe finally of getting a Bach off, we'll be back in that, and it'll be lots of fun. And it'll be at the tank. It's the day before Thanksgiving, so I kind of figure that somebody I know, because I know six different people with season tickets, someone's going to be like, hey, do you want to go? And the last three times someone has asked if I wanted tickets, I've said no. But this time I can say yes, because I can go. So watch, nobody will offer. But I think with it being the night before a holiday that someone's going to have extra tickets. It's going to be amateur night because the diehards are going to be busy filing turkeys or doing something similar, so we'll see. I also almost went to, oh, I went to Target and I bought mouthwash. It was very exciting. They did not have anything I wanted. There were some, uh, some, uh, bla oh, I can't think of what they're called now, blasters of Allen and Ginter, but I didn't buy any. That's all the time we have for today. Visit us on the web at joelshitshow.com. Email joel at joelshitshow.com.